guys, Caleb here. Um, today is a very special day. Um, today is the 200th episode of my TTML day, and that is really awesome just to think that's that's a lot of episodes, and uh, it means so much that you've uh, supported me all these uh, almost two years, it could be a year and a half, that you enjoy the content, and that's what I always hope to bring. Um, I always hope uh, to give you an idea of somebody to send to or to show who's signing. Uh, I know when I first started, you know, I wanted to uh, you know, add to my autograph collection because I was just getting into it. And then also uh, show when I was getting back because you know, I saw all these other videos of awesome people doing here on YouTube that have really helped me out a lot as well. Um, and then I just started, you know, I can you know, help other people who want to get into the hobby help uh, give people ideas of who else is into to further their collection um, to add on to it and you know with World War II that is an awesome project that I've been working on. It's a lot of history to you know bring back those men and women who sacrificed so much for us so we can make our videos today um, and remember them and honor them. And we'll also see RD cards, uh, Nick from the Nickster, um, Sean Hewick, uh, Lots of people will go and uh, look up those World War II veterans to send to them and uh, keep, the, uh, keep them in our memories and stuff. You know, not forget about them. Let them know that they're remembered and their source is appreciated. Uh, so that is really awesome to uh, see that uh, unfold. Um, what I want to do is do a giveaway. Um, it's also going to tie into my two year anniversary of doing TTMs. Not the, two years on the, uh, my channel, that won't be till around July, but uh, just for, uh, I started out TTMs uh, officially about next week, it was on the 11th, the 13th, if I remember right, uh, I started on the first TTM back in 2014, I want to do a two year TTM anniversary, as well as just a 200 episode giveaway, and uh, I'll go into more detail about that in the video for you, I'll show an other angle, so you can see the cards up closer, Lots of cards for you guys. I think you're gonna like. There will be some more on the way. There'll be some surprises, but uh, that is it. And uh, please uh, stay tuned for the rest. And uh, for more details about the giveaway, and really thank you guys so much for all the support. Couldn't have done it without you all. And uh, talk to you later. Bye. All right, I'm back. Um, got the cards here. Um, what we're gonna do for the giveaway? is uh, I got um, at least one autograph from the four major sports baseball, football, basketball, and hockey and all you gotta do is just be a subscriber and uh, you can enter in the comments saying that you want to be in on it and uh, you'll, I'll be watching the comments and uh, in the order of I see them I'll write them down and uh, we'll put them in the random.org and uh, we'll roll the dice and see how many times we'll randomize it and then we'll randomize it that many times and we'll, the first the top four people will uh, get the pick. Um, you know, like the first person, they'll have the pick from the four sports, what they want. And then we'll go on so on down the line. And uh, also, if you want one more spot in the giveaway, I'm going to have you do a little something. Uh, all you have to do is find my first video and tell me under your comment, like say I'm in or something. Um, just uh, who was the first TTM that I showed in my first video? You have to go back to the slideshow days in episode one. So just uh, that would be fun to see uh, see how many people will be willing to do that, and you'll get an extra spot, and that'll go right in your name in the in the list. So you have two spots, to, two chances to win. And uh, what we'll do, I'll show the cards here. Um, so for baseball, I got this one um, from Tier One. 2015, I think it's a rookie card. Numbered, I think, 349, Shane Green. Um, so, got that one for baseball. Um, and there will be other autos that they just won't be um, here until the contest or the giveaway ends, which I'll let it run to um, the end of this week. That'll be when it expires, and then we'll do the random uh, next Monday, and we'll see who. Uh, wins and then also I'll throw in a Jim Greengrass auto um, with everyone 
So everybody gets a gym grant. Unless you've already got one, then I'll see if I can find you somebody else. But I've already sent one to you. Um, for football, you got this really cool uh, autograph, big, huge orange patch, a rookie card of Cody Latimer. This is from Strata. It's 2014. Yeah, it's not numbered. But uh, signed on. It's not a sticker auto. And it's uh, dropping stuff. There we go. And it's not scratched or anything, it's just the cases that it's in. So, pretty cool. I uh, thought that card was really awesome, especially since they won the Super Bowl and everything. Thought it would be a cool card to send or to have. Um, for basketball, um, we have Jerry Stackhouse from 1516 Panini Prism. This is a sticker auto, but it's still it's a really cool card, Jerry Stackhouse. He was a big deal back in the mid-90s, I remember that. So, cool Jerry Stackhouse. That's for basketball. Again, with the Jim Greengrass autograph as well in there. And for hockey, um, I've heard of this guy, it's number the 99. 2000, from 2012 Panini Prime, from the Predators, Prime Signatures, Colin Wilson. That's number 8 out of 99. So a short print parallel autograph. On card, Colin Wilson for the hockey. And then there will be, again, there will be more autographs added into that. Probably mostly baseball, but I'll try and mix it up. Uh, whether they're from my collection or from eBay or uh, check on my cards, who knows. <laughs> I'll try to work something out for you guys. But uh, that is it. And I'll go ahead and get into the TTM mail day that came in today. And uh, we'll finish up the video. Thanks for watching, guys. And thank you again for all your support. I uh, really appreciate it. Bye. Hey, you guys. Caleb's Cards here. Coming at you with the 200th episode of my TTM mail day. I um, hope you all can join in on the giveaway. And I know this is going to be a decently long video. But uh, I figured because it's the 200th episode, um, I would open these letters up live. And once again, Tuesday... There we got a little decent stack there is proving to be, uh, ironically, the best mail day of the week. Even though uh, typically for, at least it used to be for me, it was the worst. And now lately it's been Wednesday. So, ironically, Tuesday is our best day. But I uh, have several here I'm going to open up live for you. Got my trusty letter opener ready. So, let's go ahead and get into the first one, shall we? So... This was sent out uh, February 2016. Coming back from Augusta, Georgia. Let's see. Let's see if I can do this and you guys can still keep it in frame. Hopefully. And if by chance I don't know who these people are, I might have to cut the video and go look up on Star Tiger. So it looks like they threw in a cardboard insert. Um, who is this? Oh, okay. Uh, former Dolphins, Patriots, and Colts linebacker. Played 68 to 72. Randy Edmonds. And my book fell right over. Hold on, let me fix my background real quick. Okay, sorry about that. Some technical difficulties. That uh, book is getting too big and too full of cards now to use as a background. So, just got this plain Jane uh, cardboard piece back there. So, that'll have to do. But, uh, anyways, Randy Edmonds, former Dolphins and Colts and Patriots linebacker. Mostly he played with the Dolphins. So, sign this football signature card. So, that's the first one. Next up. Fort Myers, Florida. Sent out 216. There we go. Let's not knock it over again. <laughs> see here, it looks like. Let me turn my letter. Um, I did write a little note. Oh, sweet. Pat Richter. A college football Hall of Famer, played most of his career at the Redskins, if not all his career. 
a very good defensive back from the uh, late 50s and to the 60s, maybe early 70s, I think he might have played too. Um, he also said the NFL season was exciting. Um, I'm a Patriots fan, or I'm partial to the Green Bay Packers, so was disappointed when they lost in the playoffs. So, pretty cool, Pat Richter. Uh, I've been waiting for him to sign because lately he hadn't been really signing, or he was charging before. I can't remember what it was. Okay, next one's from uh, North Texas, Texas. Dallas, Texas. No dates. This has probably been out there since December, maybe. Maybe November. I can't. I think I started uh, putting the initials on the back of my envelope in December. Oh, sweet. Playing Kershaw. I did so. I did send a secondary card to him. I did not have this report. So. I did tell him that I donate to his charity, so that's pretty cool. Another Clayton Kershaw. Um, I saw that I came across the card after I sent the Prism card that I got back, so I just had to send it again. Maybe if Matt Camp ever signs, yeah, I can get him. That'd be cool. So Clayton Kershaw. Next up, coming back from Tampa, Florida. Sent out February 2016. So, see here. Uh oh, what's this note for? Well, I'm gonna have to resend this uh, ace card out. Uh, Mr. Laundry is not able to sign due to the health problems, which is weird because he just started, was just signing a little bit ago, so that ace card is going to have to, I'm going to have to find another ace or tennis player or something. So, uh, hit the deck failure there. Uh, next up, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. This has been out a while apparently because there's no initial, no date. So let's see who this is. An old card. Oh no, this is actually recent, so I, so I just forgot to uh, put his initials on there. But uh, Bill Butler, unless he sent his own. Signing 64, Philadelphia? No, 65. Former Vikings defensive halfback, safety. He may have played for another team last year. So, Bill Butler. Got a few more, well, five more, I think. This one, this one won't be hit the deck. It's really light. Uh, North Houston, Texas. Coming back, 316. Well, I don't think I hit, did any hit the deck. Ones. Nope. NASA. Um, he's a NASA flight scientist for Apollo 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So Milton Windler. Signing out same Eric's card, that's pretty cool. Milton Windler. So awesome success. Get back from him. Uh, going right on. Got a from Louisville, Kentucky. 316. This might be Kenny Walker. Yeah, looks like it. Yep. Kenny Skywalker. Sign 91, 92. Upper deck. These cards are courtesy of Andrew Williams, so thank you very much, Andrew. That's one's with the Knicks, and this one's uh, 94, 95 Stadium Club, I think. Might be 93, 94. Uh, with the Bullets, who are now the Wizards. So thank you, Andrew, for those cards. Next up, Knoxville, Tennessee. Sent out. This month, 316, March. Oh, there we go. 
Sweet. Uh, 90 year old uh, Ronnie Rance. Rance Pless. P L E S S. Former outfielder, I think, for the Senators. From New York Giants. So, he's 90 years old. Got that 78 TCMA. You guys saw that. And uh, when I showed my first shipment of CMC cards, so cool to get back around really quick. Uh, next one, this one looks like it's been out since at least last year because it's got the Christmas stamp. Phoenix, Arizona. No both part. Let's see what this is. It's baseball. Oh, sweet. Charlie Huff, he signed the index cards too. I don't remember sending an index card. Apparently he did. Um, so that's a 2005 Topps Archives, I think. And uh, 86 uh, leaders card with him pitching there. He can be, he's usually a very good signer. just depends. He can take many years or he can be within a week. So you never know with him. But I think he is a pitching coach for the minors, so he did sign index cards. So that's pretty cool. Charlie Huff, great knuckleball pitcher from the 70s, 80s, early 90s. I'm um, definitely a pretty cool pitcher. Um, definitely underrated. Um, didn't have quite enough wins to make the Hall of Fame because he had well, about as many wins as he had losses. So that kind of hurt his chance, but he still is a very good pitcher. So next up. Coming from who knows where. This has to been out since at least December. It included three extra stamps. Or she, don't know. Let's see who this is. It's looking it looks like the baseball huge press, I can see that much to it. And they included something extra in there. Letters, cards. Unfortunately, he didn't sign it. Okay. So this is Louis Omo. Uh, I actually put the stamps on. This is coming back from... Uh, so, what happened here? He's a former Brooklyn Dodgers player from 1947. Did he die? Huh. Uh, so I just saw somebody on Star Tag about three months ago get him back. So unfortunately, I mean his son wrote on behalf of her, I guess, or his uh, grandson. So he's not. Uh, um, so basically, he's probably suffering from Alzheimer's. So that's a bummer. He's unable to sign anymore. So well, he is 96, 97. So still cool. Um, included. I can use that hewograph again included this little picture and then <laughs> they they made like his own card on like they took like a, a little bit newer version of Alan Ginter at least I think it doesn't look original <laughs> and then like put one of his old photos on the back so that's kind of cool but yeah unfortunately he is unable to sign so I'll still count as a success because I did get a response. I did technically get an autograph from a family member, so that still counts. So but that's a bummer to hear that former uh, 47 Brooklyn Dodgers. Not very many guys from that team are still living. So I mean, I think I sent to Puerto Rico. I think so. Still nice mail day, and uh, hopefully, uh, I think I'll have some eBay stuff coming tomorrow. So at least we can count on that to show off real quick. But uh, definitely make sure you uh, enter the giveaway. Uh, it's open again to all subscribers. And uh, I'll quit rambling. And uh, stop this video because I know it's been going on for a while. And uh, talk to you later. Bye.